Hello, this is Blakey Rat. Uh, quite a while ago, I did one of my uh, little 10 minute videos on a game called uh, Dreamscapes the Sandman, and it's one of those little adventure games. Um, nothing too special about it, but for the type of adventure games that I normally, excuse me, I normally play, it actually had pretty good production value, so I'm gonna go ahead and play through it. Why not? And uh, hopefully, it's a short game because. As you know, when I uh, do full playthroughs like this, I I usually end up, um, you know, sucking. Okay, so um, we're gonna do regular mode, and let's watch the cutscene. Are you having bad dreams? They say our brain makes up nightmares for us to handle the reality better. But who knows where the edge separating reality from dreams is? Daddy, Daddy is home. Daddy, I had a bad dream again. He he came to me again, and when I refused, he started tormenting me. I was afraid I would never wake up. Don't be afraid, honey. He will never come again. Look what I brought you. He can't find you now, so don't be afraid of nightmares anymore. Um, alternate title, Uncanny Valley, the game. But sometimes, when you lose your guard, when everything seems good, your nightmares, your childhood fears, become real. And what should you do if waking up becomes impossible? Doctors lift hands. I like that. I'm Laura Young. To be honest, usually I look better. But when you're in a coma, it's pretty hard to look good. And here's Professor Sanders. He built the dream machine, and apparently he wants to help me. Oh, and you must be the volunteer who suggested saving me. Well, if you succeed, I would be very grateful. Okay, uh, let's skip the tutorial. I've played uh, adventure games before. Um, in my usual, uh, super high quality, uh, let's play, uh, method style, I'm actually eating raspberries and, uh, drinking some, um, I think it's Glen Fittage. Uh, so, you know. Also, my, uh, my phone pings when I get text messages. Okay, anyway, let's Damn, talk to, uh, this the guy. The power unit didn't start again. My friend, I am too old and it is hard for me to walk. Will you look for some fuses and replace them while I am checking the settings of the dream machine? I seem to recall that one of my major uh, complaints about this game when I first played it is that one of the fuses is like inside a light bulb or someplace even more ridiculous. Okay, this poster represents the experiment I volunteered for. I'm going to go inside this concert violinist's brain. And, oh, I have a journal. That's good. Um... I'm Laura Young. I've decided to start keeping a diary. Okay. Uh, I live with my father. Good job. I have a birthmark that looks like this symbol. So does my dad. My dad says the symbol means I'm special. When I turn 21, yada, yada, yada. Um, I can't view page three, I guess. Oh, no, there it goes. I just have to click the ribbon. I have a friend named Tim. Tim's family lives in the neighborhood and we are close. They say we're like peanut butter and jelly. I wonder if we'll still be close when we grow up. Probably not. No, I think Tim probably hates you. Holy shit, skip to page 39. Tomorrow's my first big concert. I haven't been this aside in a long time. Tim has been a fantastic support to me during rehearsals. I'm so grateful to him for all his help. Whoever translated the journal did a much better job than the person who translated the, uh, the dialogue uh, during that cutscene, which was half gibberish. Uh, the Sandman is just a nightmare, and I have my dream catcher with me, but I am afraid to imagine what will happen to me if he returns. Okay. So there's this evil monster called the Sandman who invades her dreams, apparently. It's not a good thing. We're in the basement of a hospital. There's no bed available upstairs. Okay, so I have uh, one fuse. And, uh... Uh-oh. No one gave a thought to the designer sensor panels, so, um... 
Gonna need to find a screwdriver. How do I uh, get out of? Oh, there we go. It's hard to hit the down arrow because uh, it kind of opens your inventory when you move your mouse down there. But whatever. Um, I'm playing this game because it's something that I hope will not tax my brain too hard. Not because it's. I'm expecting it to be like the greatest gaming experience in history. What is? Is that the scroll bar? Anyway. Uh, Ho Chi 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 Kuna. Uh, if my memory serves right, these are formulas for chloroform. Barbital, all sedatives. Awesome. That's good. It's an empty bucket. Okay, we won't worry about that then. There's a lock here. Where is the key? I don't know. Let's find it. Check the drawer. Uh-oh, it's nailed shut. Okay, so we need something to pry those nails with. Uh, Prince for Sleeping Beauty found. I bet I am the, the Tim friend that she's been talking about, and the game is like leaving it like a secret. Mm. Whoop, I didn't mean to do that. Um, I'm trying to... Yeah, that's frustrating. Okay. Let's see, what else is there to explore? There's... Oh, the hourglass. I think this is where the... Uh, Screwed up. I don't, it doesn't fit. What do you mean? I want to open it. I don't care if it fits. Okay, so let's see. Where was the hammer? Um, I already looked in that drawer. No hammer there. Is there another drawer I can open? Empty bucket. There's no hammer in the bucket. I know the hourglass has a fuse, but I need the hammer to break it open. That cloth is nothing. Okay, um, let's see what's to the right here. Maybe I missed something. Do I see a sparkle down there? No, I thought I did, but I guess I didn't. Okay, well, we can open this at least now, so we'll do that. Okay. Okay, so I can put in the fuse I got. Doesn't really help me much. Hurry up! The girl's fate is in your hands. Ugh! What a creeper. Uh, wait. I saw a magnifying glass. Oh, is that this guy? The fluorescent lamp is annoying. I'll try to ignore it. Oh. Hmm. Not all the fuses are replaced yet. Okay, I know that. Let's go back into the other room here. Uh, oh, maybe this wasn't such a great idea because I'm stumped. Man, I got further than this one. I did like a freaking. Okay, I'm gonna hit the hit button. I already looked at that. Oh, wait, that's where the hammer is. Jesus. Okay, so now that I have the hammer, I can do stupid stuff like this. And look, there's a fuse. God, I can't believe where the hammer was that whole time. And then I can do stupid stuff like this. Yeah, pull out those freaking nails. And that'll be a key in there. Which is here. And a sponge. And the sponge is important. Believe it or not, I remember this puzzle. Because you can use the sponge to clean off the whiteboard, or I mean the blackboard. And it reveals triangle plus circle. Well, what could triangle plus circle be? Hmm. I wonder if that's a combination. Triangle plus circle. Oh, look at that. Now I have this open. So, one of the mechanics in this game is you can just, like, if you click stuff in the right combination, you can shove it out of your way. Uh, when you get a scene like that. Which is fine. It's not like a hidden object game. It's it's more like an actual, you know, adventure game. Well, I'm trying to replace the fuse, but my inventory doesn't work as well as you'd like. Okay, there we go. My machine's all ready to go. Set, my friend. Yes. Just a few moments and you will enter this girl's dream. Am I fucking ready? ready? I am going to click this stupid looking helmet and that is going to signal that I am ready. Oh yeah. First person shooter. Okay, so I'm gonna go inside her coma. 
This is a good idea. I just knocked something off my desk. Hmm, I can't see what it is, so who gives a shit? Okay, this is her coma. Um, there's a church, and uh, there's a dream catcher. What is this, like an eyeball? And a really scary clown. Okay, well, let's talk to the little girl. Uh-oh. Okay, so she's been kidnapped into the church. So, like I said, this is obviously, like, a not high-budget game, but it's also better than most of the most of the hidden object slash disposable adventure games are. And by that, I mean the adventure games that go on the, um... I don't know what that does, exactly. That go on to, like, those uh, uh, big fish game sites, stuff like that, that do, like, oh, there's a new game every single day, and every single day it's, like, an adventure game like this one. Uh, one of the mechanics of this game that you get is you can you can uh, neutralize beholders, which are basically little floating eyeballs in every scene. So if you can find little eyeball bugs... Okay, don't trust what you see. I'm alive. Save me. Oh, look at that. I found one of the beholders right there. Okay, so I've gotten one, one of four medallions. That's good. There's a medallion here, I think, right? Yeah, two of four medallions. Okay. Um, there's one of the eyes there, see? I'm good at collecting eyes. Okay, I've neutralized all three beholders on this screen. Okay, anyway, uh, this is Latin. Abandon all hope, ye, you who enter. Not very encouraging. Well, that's true. Hey, look, it's a doll of a guy. And I can remove some of these rocks to reveal... What is that? A sieve. A sieve. A sieve. A sieve, a sieve. Okay, anyway, let's, um... I think I've done everything I can do here, so let's go inside. Oh, no! It's... This is what the medallions are for, I think. I need to find all the pieces first. Okay, well, I can't even start the puzzle until I have all the pieces, which is odd, but whatever. Um, so we need to find a couple more medallion pieces. Let's go here. Okay, so there's a ribbon. I can't reach it. I should raise the elevator first. I suppose this thing's an elevator. Yeah, okay. Here's one of our eyeballs that I'm supposed to capture. Okay, there's another eyeball somewhere on this screen, but it could be on one of the zoomed-in areas, too. What is this? I think the peculiar... Uh, <laughs> I think this peculiarity of mine that Dad is talking about is connected with my dreams. The thing that I can control... The thing is that I can control my dreams. Oh, okay. Well, that might come in handy. Oh, hey, look. There's a disc. Uh, one of the orbs was underneath. And here's the second eyeball on the screen. So look at that. Good. Kicking ass. And, uh, whoa. This is a puzzle. Okay, some pieces are missing. So we'll wait on that until we have all the pieces. And I think there's just one more disc. Yeah. Seriously. Is he waiting for me? I need part of the clown is missing. Okay, well, that's great. I'm not surprised to find a clown in the stream. I kind of am, honestly. Okay, there's one of the pieces for that other puzzle. And it looks like, oh, I need something to dig in the sand, but I don't have anything yet, so I think I'll need a shovel. Oh, wait, what is this? A butterfly net? Can I dig in the sand with that? No. Not quite right, I'm afraid. Is that an eyeball? It is. Gotcha. There's another eyeball somewhere on this screen. Oh, it's right here. Good at eyeballs. Yes. Look, there's 101 of those left. Um, yeah, I didn't find a disc here, so that's no good. I do have a butterfly net, though, and I think... Wasn't there... Am I crazy? Wasn't there something I could butterfly net on one of the screens? Okay, we already went through all this stuff. Can I use the net to grab the... I don't think so. To grab the ribbon? No. It doesn't even, like, basically humor you on that one. It doesn't even have a message that says that's not a solution. It just goes away. Uh, oh man, I might need to hit the hint button. So I'm one... I think I'm one disc short. Yeah, I'm one medallion short. 
Well, let's check the clown again. There must be something I'm missing with the clown. I don't have anything that's going to fit in his head. I don't have enough pieces to solve the elevator puzzle. I have something called a paper father, but I'm not sure why. Uh, let's check this screen again. I already looked here. It's very hot down there. Okay, that's going to come in handy later, I assume. Can't grab that. Hmm. Wow. I don't think there's anywhere else I can go. What is this, by the way? Okay, that's a thing. I don't know what it is, but it's a thing. There's already a disc here I already got. It's a dream. Everything's just a dream. Right. I know we're inside a dream. What? Oh, shit. I, I know what to do. Uh, I have a uh, sieve, a sieve, suv, sav. It's one of those words. I can use that in the sand. Oh, damn it. Come here, clown head. Look at this. Boom. Hell yeah. Uh, I didn't find it. Oh, there we go. There's my medallion piece. Good job. Okay. Now, I have all the pieces I need to solve this door puzzle. Okay. So I assume what I do is I stop the rotation of each piece when it's lined up with the image in the middle. So the top's going to stop now. Oh shit, they get faster. Holy shit, this is going to be challenging. Uh, I guess. Woo! Did I do it? Okay, yes, it has a laser scanner that goes down the image when you do that, I guess. Mm. And now I can enter the church and drink some scotch in that order. 